Well, tonight, there are questions about what happened at a local power plant. That plant has been shut down for 10 days after a fire there on site that some neighbors say was really terrifying. Our senior investigative reporter Bob Siegel tonight explains what we know and what we don't know that has nearby residents on edge. This is Duke Energy's Noblesville generating station. Tonight, it's finally running at full capacity, but for the past week and a half, this power plant was completely offline because of this. Very significant fire. Neighbors say they saw flames at first shooting 40 feet into the sky. The fire burned for nearly 18 hours. Some neighbors were even told to evacuate. And while the fire was upsetting, some folks are even more troubled by a lack of information from Duke Energy. We haven't heard nothing, ain't heard nothing, ain't seen nothing. Why haven't they sent us a notification? I want to know if it was human error or if it was a mechanical error. Could this happen again? What caused the fire? We don't know that yet. That is the focus of our investigation. While Duke Energy is still looking for answers, the company says the plant is now safe to reopen. What led up to this fire that shut down a local power plant? And why did neighbors get so little information? 13 investigates tonight at 11.